But right now, from the dresses to the rings, we're going to talk about jewelry. And joining me from um, uh, is Brian Rouse from Bay Area Diamond Company. Gorgeous, gorgeous store. Um, hard time if I'm in there getting out of the store <laughs> without something, without buying something. And uh, Brian, so good to see you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, first of all, let's talk about what's hot as far as um, the engagement ring goes, because I'm seeing a lot of celebrities who are going away from um, the traditional and they're doing something a little a little different. Um, tell me about that. Well, the different colored diamonds really say a lot about the, uh, the woman's personality. Uh, whether you're talking about the, the, the champagne colors, the cognacs, the browns, the, the yellows or the blues or the reds. So they're getting more personalized with the diamonds, tending to stray away a little bit from the traditional white. We have some video of the champagne, and it yes. is absolutely gorgeous. Um, and uh, um, I think it's beautiful if you want to do something different. And it's also, um, it's, uh, you know, not too far off the beaten path as far as it's going to, you know, stand the test of time. Yes. Here it is. Look at this. Yeah. Wow. So it's a regular diamond. How, how does it get that color? The earth, uh, you know, years ago when the, the earth formed these diamonds, it has to do with the pressure and uh, uh, the different oxygens that were in the air is what put in the ingredients into the diamond, basically. So it depends on basically where they were and where they came, were mined from, is the different colors that they tend to be. Interesting. Now, man can also alter the white ones to be colored, but okay. there's natural colored and then there's enhanced. Okay. So. Black diamonds. Talk about elegant black for a diamonds. wedding or just maybe yeah. you need a new cocktail ring. Yep. I didn't know about black diamonds, but sure. I'm dying to find out about them. Sure, sure. Black diamonds, uh, they tend to be a little, uh, they say about your personality, a little dark and mysterious. Mm. So uh, the black has been really popular this year. Uh, we, we see a lot of the uh, the new pieces that are coming through for Christmas tend to have the black diamonds. That's gorgeous. Um, blue diamonds? Blue. Blue is uh, all the colors tend to say a little more exciting of a woman. They are a little bit more loud. They want to get noticed. So the blues, the yellows, and the reds are a little bit more uh, a live, exciting person. That's really, really pretty. Maybe not for if you didn't want to do that for a wedding ring, but just another second, ring. Yes, yeah, yeah. second a, ring. A lot yes. of the colored stones tend to be a second ring. Yeah, it's gorgeous. And I think we've got some video of, of yellow as well. My, my grandmother actually had a, um, uh, has um, a yellow diamond, sure. and it's you know, and that is her wedding ring, and it's definitely um, people notice it. You right. know, they do get a lot more noticed than the traditional. That's gorgeous, but still, people are going for the traditional. Traditional is still always the most popular. Yes. What's the most popular cut? Oh, it's about 50-50 with the princess, which is the square or the round. The round is always the most elegant cut stone out there, so it tends to be the most popular, but they're about 50-50. Now, one of the things that you guys do that's super cool that um, I don't know of any other area jewelers that do this, you actually go directly to the source to get um, these diamonds, and you guys are leaving soon. Tell me about yeah, that. We, we go to Antwerp, Belgium. That's what really sets us apart. Antwerp, Belgium is where 80% of all the world's diamonds pass through. It's the cutting capital of the world. It's To, to, to give it a, a comparison, it's kind of like instead of going to the flower shop to get the bouquet, you get to pick through four or five bouquets. I go to the fields in Holland, and I pick the most perfect flowers in the world, and I bring them back for you. That's got to be amazing. We, this is video of your trip um, when you go, and you guys are, again, you're leaving. In, leaving in a, on the 15th. So you're October. leaving soon, yep. and um, maybe for a guy out there, or um, if you know a guy who's thinking about popping the question, it doesn't get more special than that to actually you know, talk to you about the kind of diamond you want. It doesn't, and we don't even charge extra for this. This is something that it's, it's very romantic. It's very special. And, it, and it's, it's a great opportunity. It is. So basically, what, somebody can come to you and say, Brian, yeah. I am looking for this. I want my fiance's wedding ring to be like nobody else's. Right. And we sit down, we go through everything. Uh, you know, we're a very educated store. We, everybody in that store knows um, the qualities of the diamonds. And we sit down and say, what's important to you? And then we go to Antwerp and we sort through 50, 60, maybe 100 different diamonds and we bring back the absolute best diamond we can for you, as opposed to just picking through the four or five in most stores. And then you'll, you know, put, you know, help you pick the setting because that's a whole other thing. Pick the setting. We actually set it in the store. I'll sit down and set it. You can go have lunch and come back. It's done. Same you know, day. I, 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 the one thing that I do think, um, a quality diamond, I think is so, it will stand the test of time. It'll keep its value. Um, and, and yeah, you know, it's just, you don't want to be messing around with that. Yeah. You know, make sure you know what you're getting. Absolutely, for sure. absolutely, for sure. And I, I hear, I hear you, you have one for me. Well, uh, you were talking about not wearing your your diamond because it might fall down the sink. So I brought this this little seven carat. Oh. And I don't imagine that one would fall down the sink. So you could wear that, you know, here. I. Yeah, uh, I, I feel like I'm at the Academy Awards. That is unbelievable. Un, 
Absolutely gorgeous. Wow. I don't know if I'm going to, I don't know if I'm going to give this back, Brian. So good to see you. Have a <laughs> yeah, wonderful too. trip. Thank and you. Uh, seriously, um, I can't think of an, a more romantic thing to do than, uh, uh, you know, have your diamond ring picked out in it, Belgium. It's a yeah. very special, yeah. Yeah. yeah.